Hey, what is going on, Colts Nation? Welcome back to Bring the Juice. Guys, just wanted to give a quick video because um, it was tweeted out by Nate Atkins of the Indianapolis Star. Um, he kind of talked about this, you know, in the wake of now the Rodney McLeod signing the Colts had yesterday. Um, a free agent for the Colts to watch now is cornerback Steven Nelson. So he gave a little bit of, of this by kind of giving a little bit more information on Steven Nelson. So he was a teammate of McLeod last year in Philadelphia. He was drafted to Kansas City in 2015. Keep in mind, Chris Ballard was their director of operations in 2015 in Kansas City. He also, the last three seasons, has been a starter, right? He Last year, he was with the Philadelphia Eagles. Two seasons prior, he was with the Pittsburgh Steelers. So he's a guy that has plenty of experience around the league. And also, he's a stronger zone corner, 29 years old, so still – um, in his prime years, you know, getting closer to that 30 mark. But overall, guys, I wanted to give my initial reactions to this because I think it's pretty obvious at this point the Colts are in need of another cornerback, another veteran cornerback with Rocky Sin, with both him and Xavier Rosen presumably not coming back to the team this year. Obviously, Rock traded to Vegas and Xavier Rhodes still out there. So my reactions to this, I think it would be a good signing personally. I mean, we all know the parity of the NFL, right, with the injuries, especially I feel like offensive line and also cornerback. I feel like you need to bring in a couple new ones about every year because, I mean, it's so, so easy. I mean, we saw it so easy from year to year to have all of a sudden your number four corner is playing a lot of snaps, right? Now, right now, the Colts obviously have – they still have Isaiah Rodgers, who really took a step last year. They still have Kenny Moore. They signed Brandon Faison. So they have three corners that you feel like are dependable, if not really good. And I think just adding Steven Nelson would be a nice veteran presence in there that the Colts are lacking right now at the cornerback position. Um, there are some connections, obviously, to – you know, the guy they just brought in, Rodney McLeod. There's some connections to Chris Ballard. And the guy is durable, right? He's durable and he's been productive. Last year, um, he had a pretty decent year as well. He's 61.5 grade on pro football focus. You know, that's not too far off from what Isaiah Rogers, Rocky Sin, and Kenny Moore all had last year. So I think overall, this would be a nice veteran signing for the Colts here in free agency. I don't think he'd command a whole lot of money. And you could get him on a one or two year deal and feel pretty good about it. You got, you know, at least the guy that could start some games for you and get you a little bit more depth there, right? On in that cornerback room. And then honestly, guys, I don't think you need to touch the defense in the draft. I mean, honestly, I think the draft with you know the lack of draft capital, this move would make a lot of sense. You don't really have to touch corner, at least for this season. You know, you can go address wide receiver, tight end, left tackle. And, you know, if you address those in rounds two, three, and four. You feel pretty good about where you're standing, you know, if next year, right, you go up and trade for a quarterback. You've already solved your cornerback position potentially, you know, depending how long you would sign Nelson for. But I think this would be a nice vet signing, guys, all that to say. Um, but let me know what you guys think. Do you think the Colts should potentially be interested in Steven Nelson? Nothing has been confirmed like they do have interest, but I think this makes a whole lot of sense for what the Colts want to do. You know, they've talked about how they they wanted to add some veteran presence, right? They've had guys like Mike Mitchell in the past, right? They had Xavier Rhodes in the past. But really right now, what who do they have? Rodney McLeod and who else really in that secondary? So Steven Nelson makes a ton of sense from that standpoint. He's always been a solid corner, always been a pretty decent corner. And I think signing him would do wonders for your cornerback depth moving forward into 2022 and beyond. All right, guys, let me know your thoughts on Steven Nelson as a player. Do you think this move makes sense? Thank you guys so much for tuning in. And as always, guys, go Colts.